I think the big news currently in the IT sector is that, um, and it's been going on for a little while now, is that there is a skills shortage of graduates that are wanting to go into the purely technical jobs. There's um, a lot of graduates that want to go into the consultancy and the client facing role, but not as many that want to do the pure technical development, which companies are struggling with at the moment because they're not getting their hands on enough people um, for the work that they have. I think what employers mainly look for from graduates when they are looking to go into a, a role is it varies again from technical or client facing positions but really somebody that has had quite a solid grounding with the technical disciplines that have been able to pick up quite a thorough knowledge of at least one or two core um, programming languages if they wish to be a programmer. Uh, another thing that the companies will be looking for are candidates that have um, gone out and picked up some work experience either as part of a placement year or industrial placement or people that have done internships or work experience during the summer as well. Companies that you should be probably keeping an eye upon are the larger organisations um, so people that have got or are developing technologies for a number of different industries as well rather than concentrating on one particular industry. There's a number of um, software houses that have been hit quite hard by the current economic climate so therefore they're not getting as much business as possible so the more generalist IT companies are the ones that are still looking um, for the, the higher numbers of graduate. Also companies that provide a lot of IT security um, are also still recruiting quite in quite heavy numbers because a lot of companies are looking at their IT security at this, at this time. Graduates at the moment are trying to apply for pretty much every role that's out there and not, they're not going to be suitable for all of them. They need to realise where their strengths are and then tailor their CV accordingly um, to those types of positions. So if their strength is technical development, they should be going just for the pure development roles and not for sort of IT support or DBA positions. Um, so it's just making sure that you are matching your, well, your experiences and skills up to the, the client's requirements. You uh, should highlight the modules that you have completed as part of your university degree that are best related to the job that you're applying to. So for example, if you're looking to be a Java developer, highlight all the Java modules that you've done as on your CV rather than just listing the fact that you've studied a technical discipline. There are jobs out there. Um, there's still quite a lot of jobs available in this sector. So make sure that you are looking for the ones that are best suited to you. Be confident. Make sure you sell yourself properly. And above all, if you're not 100% sure about what is right for you, um, give somebody like myself a call and we can obviously advise you in the best way to go forwards in your job search.